so what you have to remove, I had to remove some parts for my uh, internal SD card mod, but you'll have to remove them all too, and you'll have to remove all this plastic here, a bit of this plastic here, all this plastic here, but keep the that little guy there, and that one on that side, but get rid of all of it, so you can make the adapter fit. Um, the adapter will cover right over that. And then the piece of the, that comes in here, you'll have to trim out some of it. But it all fits. Alright, what I did was I trimmed everything out. And this, this little guy's like paper thin, so I'm hoping that gives enough clearance. This little protection board's tucked over there. I have an extra one if I want to add it in, which is really tiny too, so I can place that anywhere, like over there or whatever. The battery will go back in here. Hopefully I'll have room for my PSV SD too, and then put my speakers on. I'm going to do that. I'm going to put the speakers on right now. Alright, I had to trim this piece a little bit, but it was all just empty space, so that's cool. So the wires will just interrupt there. There, speakers all in. Uh, it's paper thin, so it's like it's not even there. Everything snapped down into place. I tested it with just this, and it fit and didn't touch anything. So I'm gonna plug it back in and see if it turns on. Cool, touch screen works. It's just a little, just a tight fit, a little spongy in places. Just need to tighten it down, should be good to go. So the next thing I have to do is get a new battery so I can uh, splice it into this little board here off of its power and then send it back out to its connection. Oh, it's alive, it's alive, it's alive, it's alive. So I went ahead and ordered a new battery so I have a backup. I uh, soldered the wires and everything and I'm gonna close it up and give it some tests. Let's check it out. Now I can tell it's charging. I don't know if you can see it, but I can see the charging indicator from my board right there. And it's orange, so that means it's charging. And we started at 42. Focus. It's at 43, so I'm going to let it charge for a bit. Okay, I just turned it on to check it. It was at 42 for the longest time, and then finally it just popped up to 71. So, it works. Now, does it get hot? Yeah, it gets hot, but it cools down really quickly. And I'm not too worried about it because I only have the speaker there and this plastic. I might put some thermal tape back here. This little area gets hot, so I'll keep an eye on that. I did buy a replacement back just for this test. So if it gets ruined, I don't have to worry about it. And I have an extra battery, so if it gets ruined, I don't have to worry about it. The only thing I'm worried about is that speaker, but uh, I can probably get a replacement of that. So all in all, wireless charging dig it.